female endurance cyclists set out to inspire more kids to ride, as YouGov survey reveals that one in five parents has a child who can't cycle the Adventure Syndicate, a collective of female endurance cyclists aiming to inspire and empower more people to take on adventures by bike, is challenging school children to match their miles as they ride upwards of a century a day through France. Adventure syndicates, the quad team members, Lee Craigie, Ricky Cotter, Jenny Tuff and Jenny Graham, are riding up to an over 100 miles a day, from Bristol and then through France. Schools are encouraged to collectively match the miles, with a live leaderboard logging both the team's ride and school's achievements across the country. Greater than greater than greater than bike packing, everything you need to know the team began their adventure on Sunday April 22nd and they'll be riding until Sunday April 29th. Schools can compete as a whole, or select specific classes or year groups, and riding can be completed in or outdoors, there's information on how to sign up or get involved here, the school that logs the most miles will receive a visit from seasoned adventurers Craigie and Cotter as well as an exclusive showing of their brand new film, Divided. The Match the Miles initiative forms part of the Adventure Syndicate's inspiring, encouraging and enabling schools project, which saw them receive cash from the Sporting Equality Fund to work with five schools across Scotland, engaging with pupils and especially teenage girls. The team will teach camping, riding and bike maintenance skills in a bid to improve levels of self-esteem, resilience and confidence that will last them a lifetime, particularly among young women who might not otherwise take part in physical activity. Discussing the year-long project, Syndicate Director Lee Craigie said, Encouraging young women to be adventurous and self-reliant is a different engagement strategy to the traditional competitive sporting one. The confidence raising possibilities that come from realizing they can travel great distances by bike and carry everything they need to eat, sleep and have fun. Along the way can change how girls view the world and what they're capable of achieving in it. Hoy Bonnelly Road Bike The Challenge coincides with the release of stats from a YouGov survey commissioned by Evan Cycles, which show that one in five parents have a child who can't ride a bike. The survey, published alongside the release of Evan Cycles' new Hoy Bikes, showed that 22% of parents in London had a child who couldn't ride, and that 32% of parents would not let their kids ride unsupervised despite the fact that 84% were allowed to themselves once over the age of 10.